Hello everyone. Welcome to EA Secret. Imagine a tree that bleeds when it is injured or hit, the dragon blood tree. I would like to introduce you to this magnificent tree, which attracts everyone's attention with its name, most of all with its appearance. It is fascinating that the resin in it bears a resemblance to the blood coming out of the human and animal body. The resin of the dragon's blood tree contains iron, which is present in the blood of humans and animals. As the name suggests, the sap of our tree is blood red in color. Although the blood red sap from the trunk of this fascinating tree was not known until the 15th century, it is known that it was used for women giving birth in the ancient Roman civilization, for wound cleaning and treatment, and for skin defects. According to Greek mythology, these are the trees that rose from the blood flowing from Draco Hesipros, the Lord of Dragons, who tried to steal the golden apple and was killed by Hercules. He also gets his name from this dragon. The Tropical Dragon Blood Tree, which has started to make its name with its positive effects on skin care in recent years, has been reduced in the generation of trees as a result of excessive industrial use after it was discovered. Later, it was taken into protection and its generation was continued. In fact, the miraculous effects of the dragon's blood tree were discovered in very ancient times, and the story of how it began to take an active role in medical science dates back to the Chinese, Arabs, ancient Greeks, and Romans. The dragon's blood tree was used both for the treatment of stomach ailments and as an antiviral that helped heal skin diseases such as eczema. It contains components against cancer, it prevents the formation of cancerous cells by stopping the cells from mutating, antiviral, antimicrobial, antioxidant and anti-diabetic properties due to its known functions for use in minor burns or in the treatment of bleeding and dysentery are among. If we need to explain how effective the antioxidant alkaloid component of the resin contained in its structure is, the plant sap of this tree, which is open to many uses, is 20 times stronger than the known vitamin C and 50 times stronger than vitamin E. So even one drop is extremely valuable for the beauty and health of the skin. The dragon's blood tree is native to the Canary Islands, Cape Verde Island and Madeira Islands in the North Atlantic Ocean. Dragon blood tree sapling grows very slowly. A time frame of about 10 years is required for 1 to 2 meters of growth. The dragon blood tree grows on a single trunk until it is 10 to 15 years old. Then it stops growing and starts branching out. First it blooms, then it starts to turn into branches. After becoming an adult, this process is repeated. For this reason, when viewed from below, there is an image of an umbrella just like. And what do you think about this magnificent tree? State your thoughts in the comments. Please do not forget to like my video and subscribe to my channel.